It's beer at o'clock on Reload Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Malta and it's a bottle from Gallery Craft Beer and it's Valletta 2018. I'm presuming is the name of the beer. Gallery is the official craft beer of Val Valletta 2018. There we go, there's a the bottle cap. Thank you very much to Neil Long. Uh, he, likes his, he likes his trip to Malta. Uh, he, he always brings me some beer back from Malta, so thank you very much Neil Long for bringing me the beer. Let's get it out into a glass and see what we get. Oh, I think that's the first time I've ever used the... I, I think I tried to hold it back. I, I, I nearly swore. I, I, if you wind it back and slow-mo it, I might have swore. I don't know. I think I tried to hold my tongue a little bit. But that was a bit of a bomb, wasn't it, eh? Nice looking beer. 4.8% ABV. It's got a two finger white head, slightly hazy amber colored ale, good levels of carbonation. Let's get the aroma. It smells very nice. Biscuity, bready, toffee, there's some nut flavors coming through. Did you see me wink just now? I got a live feed going at the background and people are kind of just laughing their heads off and the, the live feed of, of me need, nearly being blown up by a beer. <laughs> They're all laughing. Um, I'll talk about the live feed later on. I'll tell you where you can find it. Biscuity breadiness then. Nice hop. Lemony, traditional hop, lemony aroma on the back end. A little bit of spice. It smells okay. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Hmm. Uh... I need to go again. I need to go again. I just need to make sure. Uh, I've got to get this correct. Biscuit malt. Biscuit malt, nuttiness, breadiness, toffee. I had to take a second taste. I had to make sure. It, it's not the kind of buttery. It, it was, a, a, my first thought was, oh no, it's got diacetol in it. Oh no, the, the, the beer's ruined. It's, it's not quite right. But I had to take that second taste just to make sure and really think about the beer. People have put a lot of effort uh, into, into brewing beer. Um, and I need to take my time and I need to make sure it's right before I start kind of just doing this, you know, on, on YouTube. Um, it's, it's close. It's close. There might be a slight underlying flavour of diacetyl, but it's not enough to put me off. I'm one of these people, I'll explain diacetyl in a moment. I'm one of these people, um, I, I, if I taste a beer with diacetyl in it, even a medium amount, or I mean, a large amount, I'll throw the beer down the sink. I just don't like it. I just, I just. Some brewers actually brew beer that some of the kind of the, the maybe the small brewers. You might get a local pub with a local. They'll they'll like diacetyl. They'll like that butteriness in the beer, because that's all they know, and they don't know it's an off flavor. So so diacetyl is an off flavor, and you get a lot of kind of buttery. It's almost silky in the mouth. The beer butteriness going on and, and it's just as soon as you realize it's an off flavor when you, when you learn your trade I suppose reviewing beer drinking beer 
then it becomes unacceptable. Um, I've talked enough of diacetyl. Um, I'm going to just reiterate this beer is okay. Uh, they, they, they may be just a, a, a tiny little bit underlying the beer, but I, I, personally, I, I, I'm fine with it. I think you can get away with that. It's a little bit of like a like a melon, raspberry, fruity hop back end going on. Biscuity, bready to begin with. Nicely nutty. Good levels of carbonation. It's not a bad beer. It's not a bad beer. I don't know what that was all about earlier on, but it nearly blew my head off. Um, I'm sure somebody, there's some really clever people out there. I'm sure somebody's going to do a slow-mo of, of, of this. I might even do it myself, actually, just to kind of show you guys what, <laughs> what happens with a, a beer doing that, because I think I nearly jumped across the room. Um, but anyway, thank you to Neil Long for the beer. This is Gallery Craft Beer of the Valletta 2018. Let's give it a rating. Maltese craft beer then. Uh, I like this, oh, I was gonna tell you about the live feed. Well, let me create, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm not a plugger, I'm not a guy that advertises too much, but if you wanna have a look at my live streams, I generally do them on Facebook. You can check it out at, just go onto Facebook, put into the search bar in Facebook, Real Ale Craft Beer. If you like my fit page, um, you'll be able to see that, that, yeah, my live feeds are coming. But you can watch my live feed. So I do a, I generally do a few beers. Um, you can watch. We have a chat. We have a laugh. Yeah, come along and watch. So it's Real Ale Craft Beer on Facebook. Like my page. God, I, I don't like advertising myself, really. Uh, off we go. Um, rating for the beer. Um, I'm going to give it a six. I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. It was... I don't know what went on with the opening. Uh, it didn't spill beer everywhere. There was a slight underlying flavour of diacetyl in the beer. So for that reason, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. Thanks for watching. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.